Assalamu alaikum guys, this is Manaradin Lakarmal and today we're going to talk about the personality traits and management. What are the personality traits and management and what do we need to focus on when it comes to the traits of a good personality and management? So there are some personality traits or qualities that we need to learn and I'm going to tell you about them today to you. Number one, the first one is often authenticity. You need to be authentic with your work and you need to show open concerns to where uh, to the things that you are doing and you need to be honest there. That is going to make you a successful manager. The second trait is courtesy. It is very important for a great manager to be polite, to know how to behave with an employee, to know how to behave with a customer, to know how to talk with the boss. And that is going to make that person a successful manager. The third quality is creativity. If you want your success to be successful, if you want your business, your management to be successful, you need to be creative. You need to create new ideas, you need to create new things, you need to bring up great business concepts to the world that is going to make you a great manager. The fourth quality is culture. Being cultural is very more important in management because if you are not cultural, it will create problems. You cannot follow the cultures of Afghanistan and America, and you cannot follow the cultures of America and Afghanistan. So you need to be cultural in management. Number four that we have is being emotional. It is important that sometimes we need to attach ourselves emotionally to the organization, to the management. Once we are attached emotionally, we definitely work hard and that is going to pay off and you are going to be a great manager. The next quality that we have is being intellectual. It is undoubtedly on the peak of my talent that a person should be intellectual, using the mindset and appropriate which way using using your wits, using your know-hows for creativity, for greatness. And number seven that we have is management or managerial skills. It's very important for a manager to know the skills of management, to use those skills in a appropriate way to be a successful manager. Number eight that we have is politics. Well, politics refers to the perfect ways or the appropriate or smart ways to use them for your profitability in business and great management in your organization. Not that we are talking about government politics. We are talking about the great methods and ways for enhancing your ability of uh, the management. Number eight, well, nine that we have is service orientation. Your full focus should be to deliver and give good services to your customers, to your boss, to your employees, and that's going to make you a successful manager. Number 10 that we have is being social. You need to be friendly with your employees, you need to be serious with your employees, you need to be friendly with consumers, with customers, and that is going to make you a good manager. This skill is important. Number 11 and the last one that we have is being systematic. You need to use new systems, you need to use appropriate ways, appropriate methodologies, and that is going to make you successful in making you systematic, and that is going to make you a great manager. Thank you so much for watching.